Moving on now, 150 entrepreneurs have completed a six-week training on entrepreneurship development in Oshu State. The trainers will also empower outstanding graduates with grants of $5,000 each. TVC News correspondent Rafi Hamed tells us more in this report. These are the entrepreneurs. Thousands of them applied online before some of them were picked. They've now gone through six weeks of intensive training and mentorship at this boot camp in Oshubo. Some of them have their own businesses but only need capital to improve on it. So Kona Foundation mission is to empower people who are not worthy enough to embark on small scale business. Each of them can get up to $5,000 depending on the type of businesses they present. If we are able to get the grant, which we pray we are going to, we'll be able to produce some of these things we are saying, most especially the organic fertilizer and the rabbit kilishi, because we actually needed some machine, most especially dryer, for us to do some of these things. We need solar power because for the past uh, three, four months, we've been spending so much on energy. We've been able to convert some waste from the fabric industry into making some of our leather products, converting it, um, combining it with leather in order to make durable and biodegradable leather products. Their progress will also be monitored. Month every six months and one year, we are going to check, come visit your business or get like an impact assessment on your business because we expect that after the first three months of you receiving the grant, you should have put in place everything as detailed in your business plan. By six months, we would also do an impact assess assessment. And then after one year, we expect a major turnaround in your business. So we have these mechanisms put in place to properly monitor the utilization of this financial grant. Organizers believe the training and empowerment will enable the beneficiaries to flourish in a competitive economy. It's easy managing them because they're all graduates. Some of them even have master's degree, not just um, having degrees in the specific areas where they are doing business. So that makes the job easier for us. The program had earlier held in Kano and Port Accord. Over 10,000 people have benefited from such grant in the last 12 years. Rafiul Hamid, TVC News, Shubu.